Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm pretty excited because I'm going to show you guys my perfume collection, which is not a huge one, but I've been getting perfumes here and there because unfortunately I work in a cookie factory and I can't wear perfume every day. But when I wear perfume, I really want to be very seductive, very like chic. <laughs> so if you guys are interested in seeing my collection, please go ahead and keep on watching. Also, please like, subscribe, and I don't know, <laughs> share the video. Um, my name is Emily, if you don't know me, Mimi's Makeup, and I've been so into perfumes lately. I'm not a super duper crazy perfume person. I have no experience on perfumes, but I'm pretty sure that you guys are gonna get my information <laughs> and it's gonna work. So if you guys are interested in this type of video, please let me know. I'm gonna part one and then I will create another part because I still adding new perfumes on my collection so if you guys are interested please like thumbs up turn on the bell because i'm gonna be with the second video of perfume okay guys so the first perfume that i want to share it's my favorite perfume all the time i've been wearing this perfume since i remember and it's hard to get it because unfortunately it's not on sale anymore they're discontinuing this perfume for a long time but you still can't find this perfume on amazon and i'm definitely gonna link the perfume down below that way you guys can check it out this is Nino Zerudi 1881 I got this perfume so long ago and guys oh my god I can't describe the smell it smells so good it's super girly they have musk on it they have sandalwood mm, roses I mean it's super fresh it's perfect for daytime or nighttime depending on your you know your occasion this is my favorite all the time he knows the Rudy. I mean, oh, it smells so good. I believe it's retail for like $35. This perfume, it's not expensive. It was when I got this perfume a long time ago. I think it was $65. And it was on Amazon for a while for like over $100. And now it's down for like $35. So I highly recommend this perfume. Highly recommend it. Okay, guys. So the next perfume on Tales of Paris smells so good and so sexy i love this perfume i highly recommend it as well this one smells like roses and a little bit of musk they have a touch of jasmine which is really really nice i love this perfume for daily basis but it's pretty high pricey so i won't recommend you to use it for like don't waste it, <laughs> it smells really really good as well this one it's super expensive but it's really really worth it now, if you want to smell very, very expensive, I highly recommend you this Coco Chanel Mademoiselle perfume. It smells delicious as well. I like this perfume for spring and summertime for some reason because I think it's super light, super girly, super fancy. Oh, it's so good. Mm. You can use this perfume any time of the year. Highly recommend it as well, guys. I love it. I'm gonna link all the perfumes down that way you can guys can see the prices and check it out if you guys are interested in one of the perfumes but I highly 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 recommend them all okay, so now I want to talk about this perfume that it's very very special for me because I got it from my boyfriend it's super sexy a friend of mine recommend this perfume to me and I was like okay I'm gonna try I'm gonna give it a try and he got it for me so now I'm super excited because I own this perfume it's based on um, coffee and violet so the essence it's very very sexy and simple fancy expensive <laughs> and I'm talking about the Dolce & Gabbana the only one oh guys this smells so good as well I got this perfume I've been using it non-stop nice but very nice good 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 <laughs> of now this perfume it's very nicely it's a little bit sweet but not sweet it's like an in-between they have orange almond so it's a little sweet but it really really smells good as well this one it's one of the new ones that I recently got I got it from Sephora and I don't really want to talk about prices because everything depends on what are you looking for if you're looking for something expensive or if you're in between but I always recommend to get small sizes because if you get 3.4 ounces you probably won't use all that perfume especially if you have different perfumes I highly recommend you to get smaller 
and especially now that we with this pandemic and you can stop by and smell perfume so I recommend you to get the small one and do your research before you purchase because sometimes we purchase perfume based on other people's opinion and everybody's different not everybody's the same everything smells different on me it smells different on you even if it's the same perfume but this perfume smells very very nice it's very very special I love this perfume okay guys so now I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys one of the most expensive perfumes that I own this one is from Tom Ford tobacco vanilla actually this perfume it's from the private blend collection and this perfume it's retail for like over $200 it is a little expensive mm. But I highly recommend this perfume only for very special occasions and if you're going out nighttime, if you're going to the club, or if you're going to a very important meeting. Like it, this perfume, it's not a daily basis perfume. This perfume, it's like very, very occasional perfume. It's very, very important for me. The bottle, it's extremely gorgeous. It's actually iconic. <laughs> this perfume is iconic. I. It, it smells so different I it's it's hard to explain it is a strong essence if you're not into strong essence I definitely recommend you to stop by Sephora or any retail and smell it before you purchase because it's very 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 strong so okay guys so the next perfume that I want to share it's girl mom girlin Mom Girlin, this perfume it's inspired on Angelina Jolie. This perf I got this perfume because my mom owned this perfume and I thought every time that she wore this perfume I was like, oh my gosh, it smells so good. Even that it's a little strong for myself, I think it's really, really nicely. And I don't know, it just smells so good. I've been using this one lately and I like to use it as well at nighttime for some reason. I don't know. I think there's some certain perfumes are better if you use it at night, depending on the occasion, depending if you're going out or if you're going to a restaurant. You don't want to be overwhelming, you just want to smell a little bit. So I highly recommend to use it on your wrist or away from your face. I can wear perfume on my neck because it bothers me during the the day so I always recommend to use especially because when we talk we move our hands so people will smell our perfume even that it's not even so close to our skin so I recommend that this perfume is, has some jasmine lavender and vanilla as well I'm not a fan of vanilla but a little bit of vanilla and the perfumes are very like sexy I think okay guys so the next perfume is Gucci O start start with a fruity essence this perfume it smells really really nicely i think this perfume is as well for nighttime and it's one of my favorite lately i really enjoy the essence of this perfume because you can um, smell the citrus and the oranges you can smell the roses the old earthy i mean it's very very rustic i love this perfume as well so i definitely recommend this one with a juicy pearl and sweet raspberries this perfume is so fruity and a balance of not too sweet so very very good as well. the last perfume that I want to share right now is alien oh my goodness guys this perfume it's so 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 unique oh smells so good it's super femininity super girly this perfume you need this perfume in your life definitely one of my favorites oh, it just smells so sexy it smells like walking and everybody has to stare at you because you smell so good <laughs> that's my opinion so I hope you guys like all my perfume collection honestly I'm trying to get more perfumes and I'm trying to get more into perfumes because I really really been into them uh, unfortunately I can wear perfume every day but when I do it I like to change and try different essence because I don't want to keep using the same one because I was so stuck on my Nino Zarudi 1881 for so long but I just can't it smells so good <laughs> so anyways guys thank you very much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this video definitely if you like it if you don't 
if you want to stay with me i'm going to be creating my second part so stay tuned for that one and don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the bell <laughs> hope you guys like it thank you very much bye